Hello, baby! Hello, Sine! Hello! Long Hello. time! It's so good to see you, baby! Okay, do you have a sword, by the way? <clears throat> sword? Yeah, yeah, like a wooden sword. I have pickaxe. I have. You have pickaxe? Axe. Plo. You no axe. have. Uh, you no have weapons? Dude, is there enemies? What the heck? Oh, yeah. Craft you some beautiful. Oh! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Pick up wow. the most powerful item in the game. It's a wooden sword. It's really bad. So the coolest thing is the new crop has a totem as well. It's the starfruit totem. It cost 150,000 coins, Zinek. 150,000 coins, man. What? So I'm gonna buy like three. You have 10 million <laughs> money. Yeah. What? I got. I kind of. I kind of got it from Jesse. Very nice. Okay, so the cool uh, thing here is the new update with the water. Okay, so if you jump down, you can swim in the <gasps> water. <gasps> oh, there's a hidden cave. And there is a hidden cave. And these blocks are the new mineral. I believe it is aquamarine. Yeah, you can also pick up corals. Mm. I have no idea. And seagrass. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, see, a coral, baby. So the thing here Whoa! is all new stuff. Here's some yellow coral. But the aquamarine is the thing you want, man, because then you can right. make a sword, you know? Like How about we get the, the, the new seed, though, and we build a farm? Oh, we're gonna get the new seed, man. Okay, what should we so do? Just gonna should... How much up... of this will we need for the weapons? Uh, we need like... 200. Probably not gonna do that right away, you know? That's a lot. Because it would take about, if you're solo, by the way, it will take about two hours to mine all the aquamarine to get it. Just I got some got some of the crazy gems, bro. I got uh, yeah. four of them. Oh, nice. Then we can do the blocks, you know. What? Yeah, okay. there's new right. blocks and they are very pretty. Mm -hmm. How about the seeds? You got a couple seeds, right? So we can plant them? Oh, we're gonna get the seeds right now, bro. One of the new things is the bamboo. It's a new building block. And you can only get it here. You can't buy the block anywhere. So you have to Bamboo. go here and you get a bunch of it. You Dude, I'm gonna kill the, the stale slimes, bro. <laughs> Be careful, the slimes are evil. Dude, I've never seen these before. Uh, you do actually have health. So try to not die, you know. Don't worry, Fabi. I'm strong. I'm yeah. a warrior. I'm a fighter, bro. That's, why <laughs> that's what you're gonna say like five seconds before you die. But the other new thing on the slime island, which you probably don't know about because you've never been on the slime island, is they have here. integrated a new fishing area. And what? this area also has <laughs> the hidden caves. So Oh, there's the more caves here. There's so more caves like here. And this better is, spot. Yeah, I think this is probably better to mine at because I think there's more spawn locations of the aquamarine. Uh-huh. So this is probably the spot to farm all the good stuff for the sword, man. Okay, pick that up. And then we Bump. can go get the new crop, man. The new cash crop of the west, man. So the buffalo keys you get from killing all the green slimes. And then you get up here. Don't go too close what? to them, people. They are dangerous. There's like multiple enemies. Can I try okay. to fight them? Yeah, but you're probably gonna die pretty fast. <laughs> okay, so the thing here, if you see on the ground, it's a tomato plant, then you can get free tomatoes and tomato seeds. So pick that up, man. You can get yourself free a free tomato. tomato. And the other thing that's cool now is that you can press or hold down F to uh, harvesting continuously. So you don't have to mm. spam click F all the time on your farms and stuff. So that's a good way to do the thing. <gasps> oh, it's the new crop. It's the star fruit. <gasps> oh, I picked it up. <gasps> I, I stole it. Wait, so the star fruit is found on the second fighting island just randomly around? Yeah, it does the same as the ore. So every time you break it, they will respawn. So it's uh, randomly generated. So it can be a tomato or it can be a star fruit crop. And the drop rate for the seeds are not that good, to be honest. So the thing is here, we just run around the island and wait for them to spawn again. And then we pick it up and we pray for a seed. Mm -hmm. And this is also a very good uh, starting farm. Dude, what happens if I fall up the edge? Or you die. Dude, there's an island here. Maybe we can jump up there somehow. I tried. It doesn't work, <laughs> sadly. 
Okay, so we need to get a seed, man. Yeah, that's like something you'd want to do. Like, that's a Fabio moment. Yeah. <laughs> Try to Every place that like... is possible to get up on, I have tried. <laughs> and I have failed miserably. Dude, that's... maybe you could stand on the stone rock, man. The stone rock? Man, the stone rock man. The stone rock man? Oh, oh yeah, the buffaloes. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna yeah, try you it, can. right? You can actually jump up on top of them. Hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Maybe if the stone men go on top of each other, and then you go on top of the stone men. <laughs> 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 that could work. I don't think that's uh, how the do stone they, men work. Do they jump, bro? They can jump on uh, top yeah. of each other, maybe. Maybe if you lead one up on top of a hill, and you have it jump on top of the other one, and then you have both of them following you, and then you lead them over to the rock. I would. Oh no! I heard dead sound. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Are you dead, man? Did I just like was restarting my OBS and I heard death sound? Oh no! That's the worst sound to hear in the game. The death sound. <laughs> the oof. Like Even though I didn't get any starfruit seeds at the moment, I got 78 starfruits, and that's just from farming. And each starfruit sells for 45 coins. And if Damn, I sell all bruh. of them. I get 3,510 coins. Woo! And that's from very little effort. And that's the best Bobby effort. Fabby Rich. Rich, Fabby yeah, Rich. Yeah, I made a lot of money, man. And you can sadly not buy it. So we're gonna buy it from someone else. Yes. What? Okay, so we got our starfruit seed. Which took a long time to get. Thanks to yeah, Mega Man 16 for hooking the starfruit seed up, man. And Dude, this then... Is like crazy bro this farm i've never seen anything like oh, it oh yeah it's so professional uh and i got a starfruit totem or i bought a starfruit totem i actually bought two because i double clicked it for some reason <laughs> and then there's Ooh. just a basic chest but these seeds are hard to get so these are actually all of the new stuff except for the sea lantern which i don't have yet uh, we have the input and output chest. This chest is so you can f uh, fill up all of the storage and when it gets full, like if I put one more uh, onion in here, you can see it spits one out. So this will be really useful for uh, storage systems and farms and stuff. A starfruit totem, which of course will be used as every other totem in the game. We have the bamboo block. I do not know currently how to get the dried bamboo block, but I'm guessing it's just leaving it out or smelting it. Uh, this is the aquamarine block, uh, just normally crafted together. All of the aqua aquamarine crystals you get from mining the ore. This is the polished or the uh, aquamarine brick, uh, which is this uh, the block just crafted in the stone cutter. This is the blue coral, which is very nice. Uh, gonna be a pretty nice aesthetic block to probably put in some builds, maybe caves or something, or if they add water to the islands finally. The pink coral block, which is basically the same, only it's pink, and the yellow one, which looks like honeycomb, and of course the seagrass block, and of course the iron door, which is awesome. Like you can finally have an iron door, and zombies cannot get through it even though there are no zombies in the game. I did also get a starfruit seed from Mega Man 16, but unfortunately when I picked it up from the block I farmed it in, the seed despawned. So that's a problem. Uh, another cool thing I think in this update is you can finally just stand on conveyors and hold down the F key instead of spamming it. So now the AFK farms are a lot more efficient because now you can just place something on your F key and you will go around continuously and just picking up the seeds and the berries and making all the monies in the game. Another cool thing I like is the, of course, the bamboo, which grows crazy fast. So this will be a easy building block. They have also improved the wood plank texture. As you can see here, it looks really nice, actually. Uh, it doesn't 
appear to be as chaotic as the last one, which kind of just looked like a Minecraft reskin, to be honest. Uh, this is the Aquamarine Crystal, or the sh Aquamarine Shard. Uh, it looks just like any other shard in the game, basically. Uh, and the main use I am going to use it for is, of course, the blocks, but also the Aquamarine Sword which looks awesome. Quite a bit cheaper than the steel hammer, but the steel hammer does more damage than the aquamarine sword. So with all of that out of the way, the update is good, the update is great, we're going the right track on this game, and I love to see more updates in the future, and I hope there will be more updates in the future, and hopefully get water into the islands, because I want water on my island. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button, consider to subscribe if you're not already subscribed, ding dong that bell if you want to, and have a nice day!